We believe that in our country there shall be no minority, there shall be no majority, there shall just be people. Remembering Steve Biko, anti-apartheid activist, philosopher and leader, the circumstance surrounding his death remains unclear to this day. He died in police custody after being beaten and interrogated. Now, 43 years later, the wounds have still not healed, especially for his family. The month of September, uh, and in particular the day of the 12th of September, is when, of course, we bow our heads in recognition of uh, his death, uh, having been tortured uh, in Port Elizabeth and transported to Pretoria. A series of events have been planned this month to honor the legacy of Steve Biko. We have a virtual Steve Biko month taking place in our social media platforms, um, Facebook, Twitter, and the Steve Biko Foundation website. Um, through that is where we get to express what Biko was able to accomplish and is still accomplishing in, the, in his life and in his afterlife. The home of Steve Biko was declared a heritage site in 1997 by former President Nelson Mandela. Abongile Yankees, SABC News, Ginsberg.